Hello, 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 YouTube. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. I am Julia. I am a Buffalo-based content creator and I love making videos about lifestyle, fashion, styling clothes, owning your own business, doing content creation, life of celiac, all the things. I am super excited for today's video. Cuffed, tailored, wide leg trouser pants that I just got from Abercrombie. So I just got these new cuffed leg pants and I'm so excited about them. I might be wearing them for an upcoming speaking gig that I have, which I'm really excited about. And so I wanted to style them. I wanted to try on some different outfits, try some different pieces together, see what looks the best. And I love doing these styling videos because I've gotten so many comments from you guys saying that these really help to inspire you to put together different outfits, to play around with different pieces you have in your closet. And since I need to figure out how to style these, I figured why not? Not make a video of it. So let me go grab the pants to show you them and then we're gonna get into styling them. Are the pants as you can see they are a beautiful like sage-ish green they are so so nice they're cuffed at the bottom they're a nice wide leg i love the waist i love the little kind of like cinchy elasticness of the waistband I love the front of the waist as well. I just think these are such nice pants. I really am just so excited about these. I'm so happy to have them in my closet and I am so excited to style them right now. For outfit number one, I have this Abercrombie black t-shirt paired with the pants. I'm going to pair them with these cutie little black leather boots, a little heel. Since these pants are a little long, I absolutely need to always wear a heeled shoe with them. I don't know if this heel is high enough. We're gonna have to see. Oop, the pants are still a little bit long. You'll be able to see. Oop, let me move. Well, let me move the dog bed. So they do go all the way to the ground. I do think it would look better with a little bit of a higher heel. I've got like a, a black heel that I'm going to try them on with. So I think that that will look better than the heeled booty right now. But just to get a sense of the look, here is the pants with this little black heeled booty and what I wanted to try on as a top. To see how it looks, all of this together. I don't love it. But I don't hate it. I need to go out into the mirror to take a look in the full length. But this is outfit number one. And I might end up changing the shoes, but let me go see it in the full length mirror and then I'll come back and let you know what I think. Okay, so the consensus is I don't really love it with this white blazer. I don't think that these are the best together. So I'm gonna put this back in the closet. I'm gonna grab my other black shoes because I think that is gonna make the outfit a little bit better. So in terms of outfit number one, how I would make this better is I would, I need higher heels for sure. And I need something that is a little more classic. I think the shape of this blazer is just a little bit too much because it's got these kind of like pointed tips right here. It just doesn't look super cohesive so we're gonna change up outfit one a little bit to make it a bit better okay so I grabbed my Madden girl pointy toe black boots I think the pointy toe and the higher heel are gonna make a big difference I think they're gonna look a lot better let's give them a shot yeah these look way better oh my god let me lower the camera so you guys can see them at another angle because these boots are the winning boots to go with this and what i could do as a little top option here i could honestly wear a little jean jacket i could also grab something super light and easy like this. So I could wear this as a cutie little tie cardigan on top. With a little black bag, like how freaking cute. Let me lower the camera so that you guys can see the full outfit one. Okay. 
I think this looks so good together. So let me try on outfit number two. So one thing I will say, I just tried on my classic black heels and black heels are not the best fit for these pants because they get lost with the pants. I think that I either need to get these pants slightly tailored, get them hemmed to be a, just a little bit shorter, or I have to wear them with a clunky chunky heel because otherwise it just the shoes just get totally swallowed up by the pants so I was gonna try outfit two with these shoes but what I'm gonna do is just keep on the black booties and try on outfit number two is gonna be the same kind of a look but instead of this t-shirt I'm gonna do this black slim sweater that I also have from Abercrombie so let me try that on as outfit number two Let me move the camera up for you guys to see outfit number two. This is outfit two. This is the pants with the slim sweater and I absolutely love this outfit. I think this could definitely be a go-to outfit for me for speaking. I feel super confident, super comfortable. It's really classic. You guys have seen this a number of times now. I love the neckline of this top. I think it looks so good. It's very tight fitting and I think that makes it look really good with the loose kind of like oversized trouser pant. Again, I think the height and the pointy toe of the boots brings it all together. I think this looks really good together. I honestly might wear this for the big workshop that I have coming up. So this is a definite yes of an outfit. I absolutely love this outfit. So let me try on. I have two more outfits to try on for you guys and for myself with these pants. So let me go try on outfit number three. So this is outfit number three. This is definitely more of a wintry look. I am wearing this cream turtleneck sweater with these kind of like floppy arms, tight wrists, and I paired it with my white Zara booties. So I definitely need to like bring the pants up a little bit because otherwise they're too long for these booties, but when I do bring them up, they work with the white booties. I think that this looks really cute. I don't love it as much as I love the black outfit, but I do think that it's a good third outfit option. Let me drop the camera for you guys to see this at another angle. So I do think that Matt and I were talking about the pants and I do think that they look a little bit better with black, but I do still think that they look good with this white like lighter booty. I really do like the colors together. What I will say is I do think that these pants lend themselves to a pointy toe shoe more than a round toe. So these booties are round toe. They're like not fully, fully round. I just tried on a different round toe booty that didn't look as good as these. These are round, but they're not as wide. They're a little bit more narrow when it comes to the roundness. So I think that that's a little bit more flattering. I think that they look really, really cute. I really do like this outfit. I don't love it as much as the black, but I still like it. Still think it's cute. Still think it's a good classic option. So let me move on to the final outfit, outfit number four. outfit number four. So for outfit four, I grabbed a tan t-shirt that I got from Zara, as well as these like nude-ish tan heels. And again, I don't think that this looks as good as the other outfits because I don't think that the rounded toe looks as good, but I do still think this is a really cute option. I think that these pants are nice enough and cute enough that I can wear round or pointy toe, but I do think that they look better with pointy toe. And what I did to kind of bring the whole outfit together was pair this little cardigan from Abercrombie. This is the pearl button cardigan. I just think this looks super, super cute together. So yeah, I honestly, if I were to pick an outfit today, I would absolutely go with the black. I would go with the black long sleeve slim sweater top. I would go with the black 
pointy toe booties and I would rock that outfit but I also just think that these pants are such a great look such a great fit such a great color that there are so many different ways to mix and match what I wanted to show you guys in this video was how I tend to go about styling outfits is I always tend to find a few staple really plain pieces in my closet that I think are going to match from a color standpoint with the item so obviously this being a sage green pant I went with whites and blacks and neutrals because I I think that that's what looks best. I also have another pair of pants, which stay tuned because I'm going to make a styling video on these. For loud or colorful pants, I would pick neutral tops, whites, blacks, neutrals. But if I'm going for blue jeans or black pants, something that's really neutral as a pant, I would go with louder, more fun, textured, patterned tops and all that kind of stuff. So those are kind of my style rules. And when it comes to pants, I always like to get a sense of how do the pants look with sneakers, with booties, with like round toe, pointy toe, trying all those different things on with the pants always help so that then I'm more confident going into styling items in the future. So this was a great little activity for me because now I know higher heeled and pointy toe are my best shoe options to go with these pants. And I sneakers aren't even an option because these pants are too long. So that's the other thing is now I know that if I want these pants to be able to be worn with basically all the heels all the booties that I have I definitely do need to go get them tailored to get them a little bit shorter but yeah this is the end of the cuffed wide leg tailored pant try on I hope you guys liked these outfits if you guys stayed until the end of this video thank you so much thank you for your support it means the world to me that you're here I hope you guys enjoyed this video and be sure to stay tuned for the next one because I've got more styling videos coming your way. I'll see you guys in the next one. Because today I want to show you guys how to style cuff hemmed tailored. Wait.